Hi, I'm Adam with Massage Chair Planet, and today we are going to have an assembly video for the newest chair, which we're very excited to see. It's the Osaki Platinum Duo Max AI, artificial intelligence chair. As you can see, it comes in three separate boxes. During this video, we are going to open all these boxes. You have the centerpiece here, you have the side panels in this box, and you have the leg rest in the smaller box. We, uh, this is very heavy, so if you're getting this delivered and you're doing like a curbside delivery, we really recommend that two different two people help carry it in. Um, each one of these boxes, uh, the gross weight on the big one, 268 pounds. The gross weight on the leg rest alone is 81 pounds. And the gross weight on the uh, side panels <laughs> is 75 pounds. <laughs> so, um, you know, all together, once it's assembled, out of the box, it weighs 350 pounds. That's out of the box. So we are going to show you how to assemble this today. We also are going to show you what width of a doorway you're going to need for the center part. So this way we'll make sure that you measure your doorways depending on what room you want to bring it in your house. So I am going to have my faithful crew, Jose and Raul, and they're going to open it up and show you how to do this. Thank you. leg rest and uh, I should mention while they're opening all these pieces that the uh, Osaki Duo Max is a dual mechanism massage chair as you can see on the boxes but just to explain that a little better um, this chair was really fabulous I tried it at the Las Vegas furniture market when they had their show there back the beginning of uh, August and it has two separate mechanisms one that's going to work the top half of your body and the other is going to work your glutes and hamstrings at the same time so this is their newest top of the line chair and we're very excited to introduce it and sell it to everybody across the country we have it on display here at our Las Vegas showroom so if you're in Las Vegas, you can see we have a lot of chairs here. We probably have about 20 on display from every different manufacturer. And if you're in Vegas, come stop by our showroom and try chairs out before you buy them. So these are the side panels, which would be what I consider the arms. This is where you have a little arm holder for the arm massage. On this model, it has rollers that massage your arm. It also has rollers for the calves. The calf massage has rollers. So it's a very, very high end, um, very good deep tissue, middle too, like mid. If you don't like too deep, it's nice medium massage. Um, it does everything. It's really versatile. But now here's the centerpiece. And you can see how well packed this is with all the styrofoam all around now this comes from china on pallets and containers there's usually never any damage when we um, ship the osaki massage to the customers but we do always ask customers to look at the boxes when you receive them and if there's any damage to the box then inspect the product inside to see if there's any damage but that's very uncommon, very low percentage.
So as I mentioned, I'm gonna measure the width of this chair so everybody could see that the widest part is really, okay. yeah, up here. Um, I would say probably from this point here. Yeah. So what are we, like 20, 28, 29. So I would say to play it safe, everybody, you need a 29 inch doorway to get it through so that you don't scratch it. So we have little twisty bands. Yeah, we wanna do this one. So this is gonna be the left panel. You can see the little hoses and the electronic thing, plug-in device. That plugs into the side panel. Mm -hmm. Both pieces, air hose and electronic plug. And then it's real easy. So you have this round piece of the side panel slides into the side and then you push it back mm -hmm. and that's in place. So that's your left side panel. And then we had a smaller box, which has some other hardware in there for assembly. I will show you what that is in a couple seconds. So what we have in there is the remote control. We also have the holder, the remote control holder, which will get mounted to the arm. Assembly instructions, electrical cord. Okay. In with the owner's manual, you have some tools, Allen wrenches, and some screws and bolts that we're gonna to use to keep the arm in place. So for the arm, you use um, these shorter ones. They uh -huh. look like about inch and a half bolts. And there's two on each side. So they do give you the Allen's wrench to use, but our professional delivery crew is going to use our electric screwdriver for this because we have an attachment. It makes it a lot easier. So you have one that goes there, the lower one, and then here's the upper bolt for the side panel. Now we're going to get the right side panel, and that is going to get put in place. You can see that there's a hole here on the side of the chair itself. There's the electrical and air hose. They are wire tied to the frame. You leave the white wire ties on, but the black one that kept it to the frame will come out. And then we'll do the air hose plug-in. And this is the most common thing that will cause the air bladders in the arm not to work, is if your assembly crew does not attach that. And you can see how easy it was just to put that in place on the side right here you push it in push it back so the front side panels is clicked into place and now we're going to use our bolts the two of them for the right side panel and now you're going to see that for the leg rest you have an electrical plug-in right here as well as the air hose that's going to get put there and then you can see up here you have an area where the cotter pin is put in there as well for the leg rest. So here's what we do. You have to first take off the bolt in the front so that can flip open. Do the same thing so that flips up. So now you have two areas, left and right side, where these will get put right in there. So first we'll do our electric plug-in, air hose plug-in next. That is so that the air and the leg rest goes in and out electronically. Now we just lift it up, kind of onto a, a hook top there. So they make it really easy now where the leg rest just gets put in. You put these back down over the posts. And now we bolt down that little clamp so that it doesn't go anywhere. Okay. 
leg rest is in place. We put the Velcro piece there so it covers all that. And we put the seat down on the other piece of Velcro. And now that's all set. And now we have the remote control that we're going to open up and attach to the chair. So the plug for the remote is right here in the front of the seat. It's a little bin plug. So you push it together and then it screws together so it doesn't come apart. That's it. Fastens there. Okay, and then you have the remote holder that we're going to mount to this right side panel right here. You also have a wireless charging port up here where you put your phone and that's another reason for that electrical plug-in outlet that we put into the side of the chair. So now we're going to take the holder and we are going to mount it right here with one screw. And that's it. And you have a little cover plate that snaps onto the back to hide the screw hole. And then we just flip it around and we're all set. That's the uh, controller, LCD panel controller. And then all we have to do is plug it in. There's a plug here in the back. Plug it in, turn the power switch on, and then it's going to come to the upright position. And we are now going to put it in place with our gorgeous lineup of chairs here. Um, the next video that we're going to do on these, this chair is going to be a uh, product demonstration video to show you all the different features and how good of a chair it is. Thanks for joining us for the assembly video of the Osaki Platinum Duo Max AI. Uh, please like our page, give us a, a thumbs up here. And if you need to call Massage Chair Planet for anything, our number is 888 346-3220. Thanks again for joining us.